a strange feeling after about eight and a half months it's kind of not real it's hard to digest since you just get in that routine of like all right this is what i'm doing that and you're looking for, forward to that date so it's it's a long time coming but very exciting it's exciting i'll say that man a lot is going on things are moving fast uh you know it's just kind of like darts going left and right um but you just got to keep your head on straight make sure you're focused hyper focused on what you're doing uh and then hopefully you know some good things come out of all this good stuff we're doing here it was surreal coming as a class finishing like kind of one of the last events that we do together besides graduation just running up here and remembering the fall and then remembering why we do this we take a one mile run up congress avenue we come around the state capitol and we come to the wall for the texas uh, peace officers memorial and i talk to them about honor and sacrifice and making sure that we're honoring all the men and women whose name are on the wall uh, including many of APD's officers, uh, and that they uh, try to live up to that expectation in everything that they do, as well as the sacrifice that they and their families make on a daily basis. I'm extremely proud of them. Uh, you know, they're, they're ready to go. Uh, we, uh, you know, we started a class of 100. We're going to be graduating about 66. So not everybody makes it through this process. It's a really, really tough process. We have high expectations to make sure that these officers are gonna be ready uh, to meet the expectations of the community. I'm looking forward to getting on the streets. Um, I have been in Austin majority of my life, so I'm looking forward to getting out there and helping some of the people that I've been playing basketball with since I was like a little kid. Um, so honestly, I'm just ready to get out there and just kind of talk to people, moving and grooving and stuff like that. What made you wanna join? Uh, quite a few reasons actually. So. A lot happened obviously in the past couple of years with law enforcement and I realized it was time for a switch up and I saw that this was an area that had a lot of need and so I'm just hoping to, you know, make a little impact and push us in a good spot. Uh, I grew up in a military law enforcement family just to give back to a cause bigger than yourself and to serve others.